Hi everyone, welcome to Sunring Yoga. I'm Denise. I haven't posted in a few weeks because I've been busy playing tennis outside, enjoying the outdoors. And as a result of uh, playing a lot of tennis, I'm starting to feel it in my body, uh, a little painful in certain areas. So I thought that I would make a couple of videos um, to release some pain, some tension that I, that's been building up probably from I'm pretty sure from not holding my racket correctly. And I found this device online. It's a bit of a roller and, or it's a roller. And they have different types of these online. This one happens to be gray at the end with this bright green in the center, a bit of an hourglass shape, rubberized with knob, little knobs in the middle. And it feels great to release tension that's been building up on the righty in my right hand, wrist area, all the way up shooting towards my elbow on the underside of my arm leads me to believe my index finger and pinky are overworking when I'm holding my racket. So, um, and then I'll do another one, I'll do a second video for feet uh, and calf area because I've been feeling it there too. But this is for the wrist. So I'm gonna place the device down, the roller down, and then I'm gonna come face it. And I'll start very simply with just rolling my palms, my palm, that is my right palm, that's the side that's bothering me the most simply back and forth trying to get all my fingers as much as I can on the roller and right away I get a sense of release right on my palm who knew we held so much tension just in the palm and then I'm going to take it deeper and I'm going to go from the palm or the heels of my hand all the way down the bottom of my forearm to the elbow and then back to the heel of my hand feels intense and you can place any amount of pressure on it. You can go light and then build to a medium and then maybe a little uh, uh, heavier weight uh, pressure as you decide, as you can bear. Nice. And then I'm going to flip so that I can do from my elbow to the wrist and back and forth, very slow and steady tons of feedback feels amazing and then I'm going to turn to do the edge of my pinky side and I can start from my elbow to my wrist but then I, I lose a little bit of space and then I take it all the way to the tip of my elbow and then I take it back to my wrist and then I can pause it there and then take it from my wrist to my elbow so the outside of my arm all the way to my pinky and then I can do so on the other side. So I can flip, not my thumb, but my index finger, and I can just take it back and forth on the length of my fingertip. And then I can also then take it a little harder to do the inside of the arm, but you can do it. And then just find that sweet spot for you. I'm completely now turning, rotating my entire arm on it. Almost said 360, not really, just three quarters of the way feels comfortable. Nice job. And then that's it. And I wanted just to share those little bits of tips with you. I hope that you find uh, this useful. And I will do a second part uh, focusing on feet. So I hope to see you for a longer uh, yoga class next time. I'm in the process of creating new videos. It's August now, August 2020. And uh, I'm getting back on the mat, trying to pull myself in, especially on this stormy day. Uh, we have a tropical storm upon us here in New York. I hope you've been well, and I will see you again. Namaste. Bye.